seriously, I have been sitting here all day and nothing and no one has entertained me. No, nothing. Mm. You know, I call for entertainment and you send in these people and they do absolutely nothing. Nothing, I tell you. <laughs> I am bored out of my mind. Do you think a mind as important as mine should be bored? Because I don't think so. And everyone here seems to have a misunderstanding about how important that is. Truly. What am I going to do? Take my carriage out for a ride for the seventh time in this week? <laughs> no, I think I've seen the filthy streets enough already. <laughs> so, what to do? What to do? <laughs> what to do now? You there. Uh-uh, no, not you. I said you. Come here. <laughs> Hi. I've seen you before, haven't I? You're one of the waiting staff, right? Right, right. I remember now. Hmm. No, I remember, like, no one from my staff. Um, yet, <laughs> you I remember. Yeah. You know why? Because of that face. <laughs> yeah, no, you have a cute face. Adorable, in fact. Very adorable. Whoever placed you as waitstaff? Well, they were so wrong. Say, how would you like a little bit of a promotion, huh? Well, trust me, you'd be treated better and you'd get a very generous amount of money in exchange for your, um, <laughs> services. Mm. Well, you're not saying no. So. <laughs> Let me talk you through it really quickly. See, like I said, I don't have anything to do today. You might have caught up on the conversation there. At least I hope you did. So, I don't have to explain myself twice. And you seem like perfect entertainment. Now I have a few consorts. Something to pass the time. Past the loneliness. Um, but <laughs> over time, you know, it gets stale. It gets boring. You know, you've seen it all. You've tasted it all. You've felt it all. Mm. <laughs> so, sometimes, I just need something fresh. And you seem really, really fresh. <laughs> you look exactly like an apple at the top of a tree. Not even fully ripe, huh? But you just know that with a little bit of time and a little bit of love, you are going to turn out to be the best apple on that tree. <laughs> mm. Yeah, I think so. 
So I want you. <laughs> Seriously, whoever put you in waitstaff and not right in front of me should be decapitated. <laughs> Oops, what did I say? I mean it though, someone find out who that was. Anyways, no, but <laughs> you're so cute. Look at you. Mm. My sweet little apple. Hmm? Oh. <laughs> Hmm. I am so happy that you ended up here. Tell me you must be one of the common folk. Oh, you are. Well, it's no problem. As a consort, you get to live out your life in the castle. You don't need to go home. You don't need to get your feet dirty on the streets. Get your hands dirty. I'll make sure that you live the most cushiony existence here. <laughs> I mean, a cute thing like you shouldn't have to come outside, right? Only guarded walks through the garden. Protected under my reign. Whatever happens outside is none of your concern. The only thing you need to be concerned about is serving your queen, being loyal, being cute, but I don't think that's going to be too hard for you, is it? Oh, I see how you, <laughs> you're blushing. I knew it. Oh, I like them innocent. <laughs> and you certainly seem like it. I'd like to know, are you untouched? You know what I mean. You need to be honest with me. Because, well, if you are, it just means I'm going to need some extra time training you. <laughs> That's fine. I would love to put in that effort. Like I said, just need the apple to ripen. <laughs> Good. Oh, you are going to be perfect. You are going to be my favorite hobby for the next weeks. Better eat well. Conserve your energy because you're going to need it. <laughs> now, guards, I want you to take this one to the bathrooms. Clean it up real good. And um, get it to its private room, all right? And then I want it in my bed by tonight. See you soon, sweetheart. Hi there. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you liked this video, please, you can go ahead and like and subscribe. And if you loved this video,